China's Lunar New Year begins on February 12th and is the biggest festival of the year, and the celebration can last up to two weeks or more. While virtually all of China's economy grinds to a halt, this new year will likely be different due to disruptions caused by COVID-19 outbreaks and restriction measures. This year's travel rush is predicted to be the least busy in 18 years. Typically, with companies and stock markets closed over the festival, there is much profit taking ahead of time. There's a period of slow demand that can seep into the global markets, and usually after the lunar holiday season is over, demand picks up. However, this time we can't be sure about how the market will react. There's typically a huge demand for cash ahead of time, which can lead to a strengthening effect of the Chinese yuan at the start of the year. Buying and gifting precious metals for the Chinese New Year is also a tradition and usually affects commodity markets. This year, platinum and silver trading volumes jumped while that of gold plummeted.